This iconic image of Charlie Chaplin celebrates the art of film, which continues to entertain and enthrall audiences across the globe. Wokingham's first public cinema, the Electric Theatre, was located just a quarter of a mile or so from Wokingham's Everyman Cinema, at number 10, Broad Street. The building, with its Dutch-style gable and its substantial first-floor windows, opened in 1913. It saw the transition from silent movies to the talkies and from black and white to colour. Its name changed to the Savoy before it was finally closed in 1951, but it holds some very special memories for those who recall just how trailblazing it was in its heyday. My first impressions of the electric cinema was when I was around about four years of age, where you would see the advertisements of the films, which are forthcoming. My favourite, Roy Rogers and Trigger. And then we had Laurel and Hardy, and we had Charlie Chaplin, the Marx Brothers. Both sides of the auditorium was like an island, a desert island, with coconut trees standing upright, some laying down, and to my amazement, monkeys hanging down. The, the, the theatre was flat, very flat. Um, it didn't have what you would go into theatres now, which is a bank. The music starts, it's a piano, a little piano in the corner. The light started to dim and there was this bright light. I can always remember this bright light coming from the back of us, through us, and then you had the times coming down off of the film. And there it was in its all its glory, Bambi. For us as children of that era, we were in awe. And we still are at this from this day, from when we what we can remember of yesteryear. <laughs>